Hi Collective, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna do a reading today. I was about to say a reading. <laughs> We're gonna do a reading today to see what comes out from Spirit. What messages does Spirit want you to hear today on this lovely Halloween evening? Thank you so much for stopping by. This will be timeless from when you see it. Okay, so a sudden shakeup's about to happen in your life with that tower there, strength in reverse. Something you really don't see coming is headed your way. So just be prepared for the unexpected. But you know, where endings come bring beautiful transformations. And for some of you guys, whatever's about to happen needs to happen in order for you to be cleared and put on your right path. So it could be a relationship ending or a job ending. Some of you guys could be changing a living situation as well. But it's like you're being redirected to somewhere you're supposed to be. I definitely see this as a new job coming in for some of you guys. New offers. Beautiful. So if you guys were unhappy in a current situation, looking for that much needed change, Spirit's about to shake up your world and bring it in. Could be parting ties with an air sign. We've got a lot of air energy here or Leo energy as well. But whoever this was, it's like you and this person just didn't see eye to eye. You were not on the same page. Definitely could have been a Virgo for some of you as well. And if it has to do with a home, some of you guys are being relocated to somewhere where you're going to feel more comfortable in a living environment. Or for others of you, it's like you've been living with a roommate, someone you didn't just fully get along with. And so you're being placed on your own path. So four of wands there could be in the next four weeks, four months. However, this is going to play out, though, it's going to be for the better because you're going to find a great sense of peace and you're going to be redirected away from anything that no longer serves your highest good. Justice in reverse. So expect because some type of injustice that happened in the past, things will turn around, but this may cause a big tower moment in your life. Big shakeups, you guys. A lot of reversal energies here. I feel like you really don't see this coming. So just be prepared for the unexpected as well. Tomorrow is going to bring in some clarity and some much needed answers. If you are a Capricorn, it's time for a change in a job situation. So you may be relocating to another department or even another environment altogether. Like say, for example, your company has multiple establishments. You may be mo being moved to a new environment in particular. So this could be a new warehouse or a new office. Um, if you're someone who works in a hospital setting, it would be like a new hospital or a new environment, new patient out care place. And for others of you, if this is specifically like an office, you may be receiving a promotion, but you'll be moving for this promotion. I'm hearing just more responsibility. So this is really going to shake up your schedule and your day to day life. You guys don't see this coming at all. The void. So yeah, literally, it's like your eyes are wide shut right now, but be prepared to embrace winter, great cosmic womb. And we do have winter months coming up. So for some of you, if you are in that type of environment where you need to, I see you guys focused on getting winter tires put on. The sooner the better, spirit saying for safety for a lot of you, because you could be having unexpected cold weather coming in soon wherever you are. Baby steps. Action. Trust your intuition before it makes sense. So if you're offered a new position or a new opportunity or a new re relocation, spirit saying before you have all the details worked out, trust in spirit's path for you and go ahead and make those jumps. Star family. So you are a part of a team of souls call and support. If it comes to having to relocate in that, they're saying to ask for help from family and friends. You're really going to be able to get through this next part in your life, but you may just have to ask for that support from others. And for some of you guys, maybe it's just really difficult for you to do. You could be someone that's very independent or in the past you've had to have this like hyper independence about you. But Spirit's saying now is the time to trust that you do have people around you that want to be able to offer guidance or be able to give you support when you need it. A lot of you guys are going to receive some type of offers when it comes to a new position. So this is going to be beautiful. Some of you may have lost a job recently, and that could be what this tower represents. And feeling like you didn't have the strength to persevere or overcome. 
Could have been an unfair situation with justice in reverse and the devil, especially if you were someone who works from home or all of a sudden it's like you could have been asked to work from home. However it resonates, things will work out for the better, but it's going to take a bit of time to get over these obstacles before you start to see positive changes. So judgment in reverse, you could be being misjudged in the workplace or specifically like in an environment you're living in. People could just have the wrong impression of you. They could think you are someone who's not as happy all the time as you should be. Or maybe just like if you specifically work for a company, it may require you to be like that super bubbly customer service vibes where you're always up and at it. And maybe you guys have just had a really rough go at life lately and having a hard time trying to keep those emotions out of your work. But just be aware because it always shows and you guys are being given that guidance and that light to really shine. So for some of you, this could have even been someone in your workplace was trying to block your shine or your path. And now you're about to receive an opportunity, puts you on the right path, my loves. And it looks like after a lot of turmoil. So it could have been the last three to six months, feeling like you just weren't being valued with what you had to offer in a specific career setting. So queen of coins, beautiful, expect some abundance to come your way. This may be part of the shakeup as well. You could have been struggling for a bit, trying to figure out how to balance all your finances. And a big lesson for some of y'all was just to learn how to balance your finances. So this is maybe why spirit really shook things up because maybe you were just casually spending too much in the past, like going out, having fancy dinners or just buying stuff that you didn't necessarily need. And for others of you, if you are someone who doesn't drive, you could have been spending a lot of money on Uber or, you know, just like things that aren't necessary. And so you could have went through the last three to six months really in a tough space. And especially if you did experience some type of job loss. And this was to teach you not only better time management, but how to really make sure that when you are low on funds how you can save and you know really like get through it so the empress in reverse coming out of a period of feeling like in lack and stuck and as well just feeling like maybe you were introverted from the rest of the world previously we've got the eight of swords so it's time for you to really step up into your knowing and really take charge of your path forward at this time that is going to be essential in kind of defining the next couple of weeks for y'all as well. Some of you too could have like had a very like fancy penthouse suite or a fancy car. You had a lot of payments and maybe you're realizing like you were overspending in certain areas like that and you were just deciding to downgrade and be more practical. I feel like some of you guys could have switched as well from just like being more carefree with your money to realizing it's better to be more cautious when situations like this do arise in order to be able to maintain your sense of peace and also your sense of stability this is, looks like a huge lesson in stability and tower moments always represent a shake-up but of course they represent you know things ending in order for new things to begin so if you experienced a job loss in the past just understand that Spirit knows that was a place that wasn't making you happy. And so you weren't able to leave or weren't wanting to leave. So sometimes a shakeup has to happen in order for you to see that you are going to be much more valued or much more happier somewhere else. And so this is what's happening in your life. Currently, you're going to be viewed as someone who really stands out in this new place of work. It's going to bring abundance in because like I said, if you are in a position where you have to represent yourself in a positive manner all the time, which you should at any job, right? But of course, if you experienced a lot of loss in the past few months, it could have been hard to pull yourself out of bed, to wake up early, to stay on schedule, to stay focused. And especially if you were struggling with your finances previously, it could have been hard to keep a smile on your face. But spirit saying, understand that all this has made you persevere. It's made you stronger collective. And soon you're going to be in a better place of balance where there previously was no balance in your life. And it's because you were holding on too tight as well. Like refusing to see that if these changes didn't happen, you would still be stuck in that situation. So we've got networker in reverse at the bottom of the card. So 
possibly for some of you guys, maybe you started to introvert yourself and you weren't communicating well with others based on all the stress in your own life. You were having a hard time opening up to even people around you, friends, family, coworkers. Um, this is another thing you had to learn as well as a lesson is, you know, you don't want to tell everyone your business or your struggles, but sometimes when you're struggling, you got to be able to open up to a couple people closest to you to really get some solid advice and to make sure that people are aware that, you know, you guys weren't okay. And it's okay to not be okay. There's always a period in people's lives or sometimes multiple where we go through struggles and difficulties. And this is what teaches us not only perseverance, but how to overcome as well. And so we've got pioneer here, passion for doing and creating something that has not been done before. So you guys have this ability to really make something out of nothing. Maybe you're building a business from the ground up for others of you. It's a career. You could be self-taught in a specific career field, but you're going to ace it or you already have been and you're being redirected to a place where you'll be much more appreciated or around those that will appreciate you more. Yeah, so in the past, you could have been dealing with a boss. We've got shadow attribute with this mediator. So it says negotiating with an ulterior motive or hidden agenda, either personally or professionally. So in the past, you could have been dealing with a boss that didn't necessarily have your best interest in heart or a company, right? It's just that they wanted to see produced results. They wanted to see their needs being met by all employees. So especially if you were at a company or a place that you know, like goes through a lot of turnover or a high turnover rate, this is why too, you could have either lost your job or suddenly quit and had to make some changes fast on your feet. It's because specifically too, that like, the way the economy is moving as well right now, if you've been struggling to find a new job, that's because, you know, all the good jobs a lot of people have been in and it's those that experience a lot of turnover that people are really finding. Those are the jobs that they're able to find the easiest but being unhappy. So gossip in reverse thrives on the power of passing on private or secret information, betraying confidences. So whoever you were dealing with in the past could have been a company or a boss Maybe you had personal issues going on. Like I said, I got the sense of some imbalance in your home or for others of you, it could have been in your finances, could have been in your mental health or someone in your family could have even been sick. But it's like whoever you were surrounded with in the workplace, whether it was just coworkers or it was a boss or it was an owner of a place, owner of a company, this person in specific was kind of betraying your trust by letting others know personal information about you. And so a lot of you are being redirected away from this situation. Now, some of you guys, this is a place that you live as well. So we've got dilettante. Luckily, this one's in the upright. Delights in the arts without having to be a professional. Alerts you to the danger of becoming superficial in your pursuits. So you definitely are someone who's very passionate about things and you could have had an interest or a hobby on the side. I'm hearing like some of you guys really enjoyed creating something. Maybe this was music or art or for others of you, you could have been a writer, you know, one of those secret bedroom writers. You write on your laptop writing short novels and, and you don't really express it to anyone. And maybe you shared this information with someone in confidence a boss or someone you looked up to an authoritative figure and they could have actually been telling people your business about this without you realizing and trying to claim that you were doing it for money or for fame or for ego when really in reality they were twisting the narrative and this is why you needed to get away from this person as well because they just really were like not only betraying your trust but telling people false information about you so beautiful collective, you're being viewed right now by spirit as a queen or a king, especially if you are a feminine or in your feminine energy at all. Radiates the regal feminine, uses her benevolent authority to protect others. So not only are you being guided by spirit to protect whatever it is that you're passionate about, but you have this ability to really protect the privacy of others. So when it comes to like, if you specifically know information about other people, you're not one to go spread their business and people around you were spreading your business. Meanwhile, you could have been the secret vault, keeping everyone else's secrets. So wherever you were working in the past, this place was a little bit toxic. 
Now I definitely see why that devil is there because you're someone with an eternal childlike mindset where you treat even everyone evenly with respect, with dignity, and you are determined to be kind to others and you could have been in a situation where others were being unjust towards you. Now that really makes sense because we got justice in reverse, the devil card. At first, a lot of that wasn't making sense to me because I felt like either this is somewhere you live or a career, but now it's really clear as day. This is a career situation where wherever you were, you were the top of the skills, you were top in your trade, top in your company, but your authoritative figure over you, boss or even an owner, this person was not treating you with justice. They were definitely spreading your personal information or if you say you had a lot going on in your personal life, this person was telling others about it. Wow, so I just had low battery mode show up even though I charged my phone before doing this reading. So there you go. This person was definitely like probably taking advantage of the fact that you could have been low battery yourself, like feeling just drained all the time or going through a difficult period in life. And this person was betraying your confidence in some way. Could have definitely been a Libra or a Taurus that was doing this to you with the Empress in reverse. Definitely could have been a feminine energy as well. So if you have a feminine boss, authoritative figure or owner above you, this is who it was. Smiled in your face, talked behind your back type of vibe. So you're being moved to somewhere you're going to be appreciated for your original ideas. You're going to be valued. And most importantly, you're not going to be gossiped about anymore or treated unfairly. So trust this tower moment. Trust that the worst of it is over. If this has all recently happened, things are going to start to close out those cycles and all the struggles you went through, especially if they were placed on you for no reason by others. You know, some of you could have felt like trapped in a place of employment, like you had no choice but to leave. And then by you leaving, it made you financially completely drained or very close to being. And, you know, people around you could have known that you were going through this struggle, but almost like forced you out the door. So I really feel like you could have been made super uncomfortable in the past. And now things are about to turn around and you're going to receive beautiful rewards for standing true and standing strong. And most importantly, just deciding to let things be and trusting the plan for the universe. That is the biggest message I see here. So I was guided today to make couple of messages from my spirit team so it's almost like the trick-or-treat bowl hidden knowledge what do we got let's see what comes out wow so tomorrow so something significant is going to happen tomorrow and next week it's going to bring you on your right path you guys got a couple lucky numbers here two two three and of course one 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 beautiful so drop it in the comments if you're ready to claim this energy. I will definitely leave a definition for y'all of 222 and 111. But 111 just really represents manifestation and trusting where the universe is about to guide you. 223 represents something about using your heart more and just really using that unconditional love for others even if they don't express it to you. So in a sense, just having forgiveness for the situation realizing that however things ended in this career situation you're being brought to a place of peace and a lot more wish fulfillment so you're going to be happier in the long run and you're going to be able to look back and understand very soon maybe even by next week why this all happened in the first place thank you for watching collective i hope this could bring you some clarity on your current career situation and go ahead like the video and subscribe Drop a comment if you resonated with this and feel like this brought you some much needed encouragement. Things will get better. Just persevere, loves.